Hey everybody, got another uh, review for you guys and a comparison of sorts. Um, the main thing I'll be reviewing is the uh, Thompson Chain Reference Bible Handy Size. Uh, this kind of gives you an idea of the, of the size differences. These are the three sizes offered uh, by Kirk Bryan. And the bottom is large print, as you can see right there. This is the standard size. This ESV, I'm not going to really open it up, just kind of having it here for a size reference. Uh, the ESV is the standard size, and this smaller one up top is the handy size. And you can see the boxes here, uh, the difference in sizes there at least. So uh, if we move, we'll move this uh, ESV out of the way. Uh, this is very similar at least uh, it's the same exact layout, same page for page layout uh, that you would have in uh, almost like comparing the, the Cambridge uh, wide margin with the pit minion. It's the same exact layout. This is, this is the same thing. So I'm going to go to Isaiah. I have a page turn found in Isaiah. So uh, 793. And if we go there in the large print, it is the exact same thing. So we look at the top, you have Isaiah 59, verse 19. You see in the center, uh, you know, chapter 59. And it's the exact same thing, uh, you know, one to the other. So it's the handy size has the exact same amount of pages, exact same layout. Uh, and it's the same paper, same it's the same thickness of block. The only difference is the 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 size and print size is different. Again, just like with uh, all Kirkbride Bibles, the paper is amazing. It's, this is some of the thinnest paper you'll find. It's a it's a twenty GSM paper, uh, maybe twenty two GSM paper. But for it to be that. Uh, that they have to use incredibly uh, high quality materials to achieve such an opaqueness with such a low density paper. So that just shows you how good a paper they have. And when you have such a high quality paper, uh, as this Bible ages, these Kirkbride Bibles will not yellow. Uh, they'll not change color uh, due to their age and uh and that's because of the quality of the materials used when they're create, making the paper. So uh, that's just a great feature. Now you can see this is indexed and, and this uh, handy size is not indexed. Um, the handy size is, uh, is about, I think you can get them around 50 bucks. Uh, so it's a really good deal. Maybe a little less than that. But it's a really good deal for a Thompson chain you can hold in your hand. And, you know, it's just really a smaller, smaller edition where this one is a monster. This large print is a beast. I mean, it is like the Eagle. It's like the wide margin Cambridge. It's, it's an enormous Bible. Uh, the standard size is, uh, is, is nice, but the handy size is much more portable. And, and like I said, you're not missing anything. It's the exact same layout. Just bring you glasses. It's a little smaller print. Um, I want to say it is a, um, it's a seven, no, it's a six point type, I believe. Yeah, it's six point type. So it's about the same as a pit minion, maybe a little smaller print than a pit minion. Um, so, but you're going to have to be prepared for that with a Thompson anyway, because they're, they're just, they have so much content that you're not going to have a large print, uh, like the large print in such a small edition. So, uh, anyway, that's really uh, the reason I have this one is, is mainly so you can get an idea of the size difference. Because if you've seen a review of the large print or the standard size King James version, then you've seen a review of the handy size. The only difference is, is the size difference. And uh, so I'm thankful to Kirk Bride for sending me the handy size. They did send me and provided this, this Bible as a uh, as a review copy, and I'll show you the front. Uh, this is not for resale, 
Uh, so this was a review copy and it's in a bonded leather cover. Um, they do come in a genuine leather cover and they do come with a, a burgundy uh, bonded and a, and uh, I think the black genuine leather. So um, thank you again for uh, uh, to Kirk Bride for providing uh, providing this as a review edition. So mainly I just want to show you guys because you know the PSQ, the personal size Quintel, the uh, the PSR, the personal size reference Bible from ESV. A lot of these personal size Bibles are are getting really popular, and uh, just don't forget that the Thompson chain has a personal size and it's the handy size. Uh, so, uh, and it, I think it only comes in King James and maybe new King James right now, the handy size. I'm not sure if the handy size comes in many different translations. Uh, but I'm sure if the demand's high enough for the ESV, uh, Thompson chain and the NASB Thompson chain that, that they would produce a handy size in that translation. So uh, thank you guys again for uh, watching and subscribing and uh, and participating in the channel. Hopefully this is helpful. Again, this is not a full review of the contents of the Thompson Chain uh, Bible. Check out, I have another review of the ESV uh, that's going to that's gonna talk about the paper, talk about all these the features, uh, really the, the no different in the handy size, only difference is the size, the actual size of the edition. So thank you guys again for watching, and uh, hopefully this was helpful for you guys, and uh, just know that that's out there, that's available for the Thompson Chain fans. It's a, uh, it's, it's a great feature for, uh, for, uh, people that travel a lot and still want to study, uh, having that handy size, uh, Thompson chain Bible there is, is really, really nice. So, uh, thank you again. Take care and God bless.